Unveiling the unexpected, the power of, that's a revelation. Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into a fascinating English phrase that often appears in both casual and formal conversations, that's a revelation. Understanding this phrase will not only enhance your vocabulary but also improve your comprehension of nuanced English expressions. So, let's get started and uncover the layers behind this intriguing phrase. At its core, the phrase, that's a revelation, is used to express that something is surprisingly new or unexpectedly informative to the person speaking. A revelation refers to the act of revealing or disclosing something that was not previously known or was hidden. In everyday language, when someone says, that's a revelation. They mean that they have just learned something eye-opening or have had a significant insight that changes their perspective. To truly grasp the essence of, that's a revelation, let's look at some examples. 1. After watching a documentary, imagine you just watched a documentary about the hidden life of ocean creatures. You might say, that's a revelation to express how the documentary unveiled facts you were completely unaware of. 2. During a conversation, if a friend shares a personal story or a piece of advice that significantly alters your understanding of a situation, responding with, that's a revelation, acknowledges the impact of their words. 3. In professional settings, upon discovering a new method that dramatically improves productivity, stating, that's a revelation, highlights the method's transformative potential. These examples show that the phrase can be used across various scenarios, always pointing to the discovery of enlightening or surprising information. While, that's a revelation, is a versatile phrase, it's important to understand its nuances to use it appropriately. Here are some key points. Emotional impact. This phrase often carries an emotional weight, indicating that the new information has a profound effect on the speaker. Context matters. The phrase can be used in both positive and negative contexts, depending on what the revelation entails. Cultural sensitivity. In some cultures, revelations might be tied to religious or spiritual experiences. While the phrase is generally secular in everyday English, being aware of this can help avoid misunderstandings. And there you have it. A comprehensive look at the phrase, that's a revelation. We hope this video has been enlightening and adds a valuable expression to your English language toolkit. Remember, language learning is a journey filled with discoveries, and every new phrase is a step forward. Thank you for watching and we look forward to exploring more exciting aspects of the English language with you. Happy learning!